Hi guys, it's me, Mitch 002. Look what I got here. It's the Mi Pad 4 Plus. Looks big, big one. Uh, the box is bigger than usual. Snapdragon 660 still the same, 4 gig RAM, 64 gig of storage. Now let's take this box off. Okay, so it's still the same white box as the Mi Pad 4. And look at the screen size, it's 10 inch. -er. Okay, so the back looks pretty much the same, and here's the charger, QC2 charger, then Type-C cable, then let's take a look at the, the this is the SIM card ejector tray, then we have the user manual, everything's in Chinese. Okay, let's put it back, okay, so... Here's the front camera and the sensor. Look, fingerprint scanner. First time in the Mi Pad series. Um, Mi Pad 4 doesn't support the fingerprint scanner. Here's the SIM card ejector tray, which can support also a micro SD card. Here's the 3.5 mm audio jack, as well as a noise cancellation mic. Here's the camera. Rear camera, which is made of Samsung sensor. Okay, it's also protruded, just like the Mi Pad 4. So, uh, loudspeakers and the USB Type-C jack. Okay, let's check. It's very, very fluid. Snapdragon 660. Um, really one of the beasts out there for the mid-range. And two scoring 145 points. Look at the stats. Okay, there you go. Okay, let's take a look at PC Mark. Let's try to load the results. We did it more than an overnight. Mm -hmm. There seems like a bug. Anyway, let's check the galleries. I already took a screenshot of it. There you go. Almost 20 hours of screen on time. This is a 8,000 milliampere R battery, and I can say, wow, it's really big. Okay, Snapdragon 660, 4 gig of RAM, 64 gig of storage. What more can you ask for? Now let's check the kernel. It's a uh, Samsung front camera and uh, Omnivision back camera. Okay. So, there's nothing much we can play on the camera, there's no manual mode, just a few settings down there, no watermarks, okay, checking the video settings, okay, we only can run up to full HD, not really the UHD, since it's just a budget series, okay, so look, the screen size is so big, more than my palm, and yeah, I guess that's it for me. Uh, I'm Mitch002, thanks for watching, have a nice day.